Hi, I'm Jason Miller with Philadelphia District Army Corps of Engineers, and today I'm going to talk to you about flood warning systems. Flood warning systems can be classified in many ways, but generally we're talking about the collection and evaluation of data, notification, and subsequent actions. Stream gauges and precipitation gauges are used to collect information about current conditions, and in conjunction with radar weather data and modern modeling techniques, the National Weather Service issues forecasts of future flood levels. As those flood levels reach a height of known impact, a notification is made. Notifications can be in, the, in many forms, including radio, TV, phone, and internet announcements, but please check with your local emergency management office to find out how and where to get notifications that are pertinent to you. In the Delaware River, not only do you get information about water levels, but you also get information about areas of potential impact in the form of inundation maps. Actions, such as evacuations, are dependent upon the level and severity of these impacts. Proper planning is essential to know what to do under the given circumstances of any given flood event. So, modern technology has provided greater access to data and information, but it is important to know what to do with that information once a flood event occurs.